What's up, subscribers and newcomers? It's Virginia right here, and I've um, done my intro a little quieter again. If you've already heard this, my friend says it's a little loud. But um, today we are playing Tinker Island, which is it's not anything got to do with Tinkerbell. I looked at the screenshots, I wouldn't play a kitty game or a game. Well, that's a little loud. Hold on. So, if you guys didn't know, I love. Oh wow, this looks cool. I love like survival games, surviving on islands and stuff. So this looks amazing. Oh, sunk boat. Deer to escape. Oh wow. So we're on an island in the middle of nowhere. Ooh, wait, into a fight. Okay. So there's going to be like enemies on this island, so we have to, ooh, okay, uh, can I change, ooh, god, it's a little laggy, oh no, you are shipwrecked on a deserted island, you must find a way to escape, but first let's try to survive, okay, so I can be Robert, Jenny, or Mary, I think I'm going to be Robert, he's got a lot of health. Oh, I don't choose, I just, I just get all of these people. Ooh. Look, the beach sands are crawling with crabs. You get crab, you get crabs. Tips, animals and some plants provide food. Food is a valuable resource. Yeah, 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 obviously. So what do I do now? What am I doing? Ah. While foraging for crabs, you notice parts of the coast that are still not explored. You find coast. Tap, tap the beach card to open the map, then tap coast to select it. Okay. Alright. Send, look at the coast. Explore the coast. Hold on, guys, I'm just going to change my body position. Alright. The sun is setting and we need to get a fire going soon. Oh god. <laughs> Quickly. Quickly. There is some driftwood on the beach. Forage it. You will need to make a fire. You find driftwood. Wood is another resource just like food. You will need it to build structures in your camp. Sure. Okay, so. Mary, Jenny, Robert, go get um, some wood for me, please. Moist. Night is almost upon you, and with it, predators, and possibly a freezing death. Oh, man. Quickly make use of that driftwood and build a fire. You know how to make one, right? Yeah! <laughs> what else do you need to make a fire? Oh, gosh. Um, matches, obviously. You don't have any on you. Nice try. Uh, what would you pick? A stick, obviously. You take a stick. Do you need anything else? Yeah. You can already feel the cold of your night and fingers and toes. Hurry up, it's soon too late. Apart from the stick, what else do you need? Shoelace. You bend your stick and tie the shoelace on each end so you get something similar to a bow. You take another stick and loop the bows. And what is your next route? Move. Roll. You roll the stick on the dry wood with the help of the bow. Roll. Okay. With the help, uh, with the help of your bow, the rolling is effortless. You can already see smoke forming. You devised a good way of making a fire. Oh, nice. You built a campfire. Campfire buildings unlock more buildings. Great. Build a fire. Two, one. Fire built. While warming yourselves at the campfire, you notice a cave entrance not far from you. Ooh, a cave. You find cave. Continue exploration of the island. Okay. The warming fire lifts the spirits of your survivors. Beyond the flickering light, the dark and gloomy island awaits. Man, this is such a cool game. Right, so we find a cave. Right, I'll explore the cave. Alright, what did we find? What was that? Oh. Oh, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a, uh, a fish. Ah. Hmm. Can 
continue exploring. Oh man, <laughs> this game is actually kind of confusing. Oh, at the end of the cave, you notice a strange pile of sand. What do you do? Kick it. Oh, the kick makes the pile move. Underneath the sand lies a fellow shipwreck survivor. Oliver joins you. Oh, nice. Hello, Oliver. Welcome aboard. Oliver was thrown off deck in the storm. He was washed ashore, then took shelter in the cave. Next thing he remembered is a kick. <laughs> right to the right in the forehead, sorry. Oliver gets minus 10 health because of the kick, sorry. Survivors are your main way to get things done. More survivors means faster progress. Oliver recalls he was not alone. His friend Adam. My goodness, people from school. Adam! Adam, where are you? His friend Adam passed out after they arrived, but he couldn't get him to wake up. Uh-oh. Will you help Oliver Troop revive Adam? Sure. Well, I have no other choice. Uh. Wait for Adam to get better. It's gonna take an hour. Alright. Alright, we found another thing. A ridge. No, I'm not using a diamond. I'm not using a gem to speed things up. Alright, what did we find? To try to stay alive and explore the island until you find a way to get home. Okay. What's this? Okay. So, I can go get... Oh. I have no food. I should probably get some fish. Everyone go collect fish. There we go, we're good now. Okay. Alright, well I guess we should go get some of this. Since there's nothing else we can do. What did that do? Alright, what's this? Resources. Okay, uh, survivors. Alfred? Wait, we can get food to get Alfred a monkey? Sparky the bear. So there's like a bunch more survivors. Wow. How many survivors are there? Oh wow. There's a lot. Okay, let's go to the ridge. Let's go back to the cave. Sounds like a good idea. Explore the map. Hmm. Ah. Explore the ridge. Right, what's in the ridge? What do you guys find? Anything? I send you guys back. Alright. Explore 30. I've got to do this. Oh my god. It's going to take a while. It takes ages to explore the ridge. Alright, well, you guys can. Oh, wait. Your party of survivors continue to explore even. Wait. Your party of survivors continues to explore even when night begins to fall. Shadows grow taller and taller, and you have no, and you have more and more trouble crossing the terrain. Right, make a camp. You feel you have to give up and make a camp. Oh gosh. Um. After you get, as you gather wood for a fire, you catch a glimpse of bloody red eyes moving in the dusk. Oh no. Uh. No one seems to notice them. Let's warn. You warn the others of danger lurking. You all start paying more attention to your surroundings. Good call. Yeah, I thought so. Uh, who wouldn't? Who would like? Who wouldn't warn their friends if you saw some creepy eyes in, like, the bushes? All right. The night has finally settled and you all crowd around the campfire. Then suddenly something attacks. A survivor is grabbed and dragged away. Oh, no. Quickly do something. Uh, make noise. Take stick. Take stick. You grab a stick from the fire and whirl it in through the air to scare the assailant away. Continue. It works. The survivor is released. Whatever attacked you runs off into the woods. Phew. The survivors praise your quick thinking. You are a hero to them. 
they will be much more willing to follow you. Survivors get plus one exploration. Survivors have four skills. Explore, forage, build, and fight. Skills tell you how good a survivor is at a specific activity. You always get the best survivors. Always use the best survivors for the job. Oh, okay. So, she's good at building. He's good at building and exploring. He's good at... What was that again? Oh, God, I've already forgotten. I've already forgotten. I don't even know, like... Um, he's good at, like, gathering items, I think. Okay. Let's keep exploring the ridge. And I think I'm going to end this episode here. This is a real... Oh, I found an apple. Oh, nice. Alright, one of the most important things in the survival situation is the source of fresh water. For now, you will have to... Be content with simple rainwater tank. You can build a rainwater tank. A steady source of fresh water will have an immediate effect on your survivors. Building a rainwater tank will upgrade all the skills of your survivors by plus one. You can find it in the build menu. Great. Okay. The build menu. So let's... Oh wait, who's good at building? Uh, you're good at building. Missing resources. I need iron. Iron. Well, that gives me plus iron. So let's send all my guys for there to there. That should give me some iron, right? Yes. There we go. Okay, you're good at building. Um, you're good at building. So I'll send you to do that. Oh, wait, do I have to send everyone in there? Ugh. Really? Right, so we're getting a rainwater tank. Okay, build, 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 build. Alright, I think I'm going to end the episode right here, but I'm like, I keep going because this game is just too good. There we go, we got a, um, got a rainwater tank. What's this? A water cistern increases all skills by plus five, but it takes 300 wood and 500 iron, my goodness. Alright, well, I guess we can get some apples. Let's get some apples. And I'm definitely going to have to end the episode here. Otherwise, I'm going to keep going. And I'm never going to finish. So, this was... Oh, wait, hold on. Oh, I'll, see, I'll end it after this. A survivor picks an unripe apple and eats it. After a while, you hear complaints about a stomachache. Great. A survivor gets minus 10 health. Just great. Um... In the top left corner of the, survi of the survivor cards is the health bar. Represents the good health of your survivors. Accidents, poisoning, sickness, and fighting can lower it. If health drops below zero, the survivor comes be ridden, bed ridden, and must rest in the survivor's menu. You must wait for the survivor to get better, or you can speed up the healing using gems. Okay. Okay, so Mary is amazing. Jenny lost 10 health. Uh, Robert is good, and Oliver lost 10 health because I kicked him in the face. Okay, well, I'm going to end this episode here. This is a really awesome game. I'm actually, I think I might be, don't tell, but I think I might be liking this game more than Mimpy Dreams. Just saying, because I really do like surviving games. I'm probably going to record an episode, like, right now, like another one. So, um, anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, uh, share it, with your, tell your friends about this video or whatever. Um... Just make sure to subscribe while you're at. It's very important. Uh, and also leave a comment down below if you would like me to play Minecraft or something. Or just a game. I don't know. But, uh, yeah. Anyway, as always, as I said again, hope you guys enjoyed this video. And as always, Regenerate, signing out. See you guys.